again I've cut out the uh, shoulder blade for this side and I lay it on. Now there are angles that these shoulder blades should be at. Uh, if they're too steep the horse is badly configured and uh, it's just a matter of learning the configuration of the horse. This is uh, my tenth uh, DVD that I'm creating here of uh, instructional DVD of uh, creating a horse After you've practiced uh, from scratch. Uh, my method of teaching is uh, point where you can basically showing you bone the basics, and, uh, uh, the uh, how to create the, the bone structure and get that uh, to a point where you can add muscle and tendons the to the uh, the bones, uh, which will make your horse a little more um, bone well, a little more authentic as far as the uh, and, uh, the sculpture goes. Um, just building the uh, bone structure of the uh, rear legs and, and the front legs and the getting the shoulder and the hips and all that uh, sketched in and not going into great detail as far as the actual structure of the bones, uh, but getting them to a point where they're recognizable as bone structure and uh, little points of uh, areas where you can attach your muscles when you get ready to attach your muscles. Uh, it, it sort of builds up in your mind um, what the horse is going to look like. Uh, you can see uh, the movement of the horse uh, at this point, and then it's just a matter of adding uh, the muscle to the uh, horse. Uh, here I'm just uh, outlining, or putting a profile of the uh, stomach area. Uh, before you can put the outside legs uh, on your horse and have them all muscled in, you have to get the body of the horse, uh, the torso and that. Uh, sculpted and, and uh, to a point where you can do the uh, legs and that without having to uh, uh, try to come back later and establish all the stuff underneath the legs or in behind the legs. Um, just shaping uh, the uh, torso of the horse with the uh, wire tool, uh, having a serrated edged tool uh, and scraping the clay, you can kind of get the feel for the shape of the of the uh, uh, torso uh, through the uh, lines of the uh, serrated edged tool uh, left in the clay. I've got uh, nine uh, instructional DVDs out now and uh, they all deal with different uh, uh, subject matters, uh, mostly Western, but uh, it's the Western theme is, is what I do, uh, but you can take whatever I teach you and apply it to whatever uh, type of sculpture you want to create. And uh, whether it's a Norseman or a, a knight or uh, a modern day person on a horse, um, you still have to know how to create a horse. And, and, uh, and then you have to know how to add somebody to that horse. And uh, at some point in the future, I may uh, uh, do another DVD, uh, instructional DVD on creating a person to sit on the, this horse. Uh, may even go into detail of uh, doing saddle and, and everything like that. You, it's just, it all is basically the same process of creating. Uh, you uh, use anatomy and... Uh, your imagination to create just about anything you wish to create. And uh, I try to give you that uh, ability without overloading you with uh, all kinds of stuff to remember. All right. Uh, I hope you enjoy this and uh, I'll see you next time. All right. If you like my video, click the subscribe button. And when you do, a little bell will pop up. You click that, and then what you do is select Send Me All Notifications for this channel, and then click Save. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs, uh, the link down below this video. All right, see you next time.